Good morning, guys. Happy Monday. We are headed to a really awesome project this morning. I'm super excited. It's a project that we worked on last fall, started on. We used County Rib Rock to build a large retaining wall in the backyard. They pushed the house up into the hillside and they needed a huge retaining wall in back that was like 300 feet long and about six feet tall. So we used County Rib Rock for that last fall and they had the pool installed also while we were there. And this year we are going back to finish the landscaping work. We're doing a big paver pool deck and plantings and everything else. So that's what we're gonna get started on. It's gonna be a multi-week project for us. We're gonna get all of our equipment over there and uh, we'll see you when we get to the job site. Right, guys here we are big beautiful home real modern looking we're gonna do a paver pool deck the pool is in the front yard which is not very common but we're way out in the country don't need a ton of privacy so it's super unique job when you get a pool out in front it's gonna be pretty cool first things first here we're gonna get unloaded I got a bunch of leftover construction material here that I got to move out of our way because this is our area now get to get this stuff out of here so excavating out for the paver pool base and putting in our underlayment fabric. This is a six ounce woven underlayment. This is what we use under all of our paving installations. It acts as a soil separation between our base rock and the native soils. So what we've done here is excavated down to the bottom of our base. We compacted with the reversible plate compactor behind me here and then we're laying in our fabric and then we're going to bring in three inches of three quarter clean limestone we're going to compact that and then we're going to put our drive grid down and then we're going to put another layer of three inch layer of clean stone and that'll be that'll be the top of our base on top of that we use a, a quarter inch chip stone we're going to have a sunken hot tub off of this corner of the pool over here so basically you can just walk right up and step right into the hot tub that's going to be uh, close to the same height as the pavers the top of the tub is but we had to we do have to worry about our pool mechanicals coming off this corner they go around to the corner of the house over there um, so we just dug down dug a trench here to see if we could find them they're plenty deep enough um, for us to start excavating so our main goal today is to get excavated and start getting some base compacted, get some drive, drive grid in, and start going on the hardscape part, portion of this project. <laughs> Go your way. Go that way. 
There you go. Should we set that? Uh, yeah, let's just fill that back in and. That's up to you, man. <laughs> Dump a little extra for you to shovel back into that corner. Or for you to rake, I mean. installing the part of the wall that you're gonna see the hot tub here is gonna be sunk down so basically only four inches of the top of the hot tub is showing um, from the from the patio height so basically you can just step right down into the tub and you don't see it sticking up on the hot on the patio taking up space um, we're gonna use the county materials smooth tribute in vision this is what the main patio color is, so this is going to match really well. Um, nice modern look for this modern home and also matches really well with the stone, the Fond du Lac stone work that they have on the home. Thanks for watching everybody really appreciate you tuning in to this week's episode stay tuned we're going to have all kinds of 
really cool stuff coming on this one and uh i think you're really going to enjoy some of the some of the designs that are going to go into this project so check us out we're going to be coming out with a new video every week on saturdays hopefully and uh again really appreciate you watching this please like comment subscribe do all that stuff we really appreciate it we're trying to grow the channel so every little bit helps i appreciate you guys have a good one see ya